If you have an herb verb, you may have enjoyed using the shimmer effect that is added when depth is turned all the way up. Before this effect was added internally, we experimented with some patches to emulate shimmer so we could get an idea of what it was going to sound like. This patch is my favorite of them and can be used to add shimmer to any reverb. The trick is to add an octave shifted copy of the reverb into its own feedback path. We can do this with the echophone by setting the pitch shifter to be one octave up. Also set the echo time to the very shortest. We'll set feedback to zero, mix fully wet, and patch a molted copy of the reverb's output to the echophone's input. Now we'll mix the echophone's output with the signal we want to affect. Let's use the DPO. This mix will be sent to the reverb's input. We can set the level of the shimmer effect using the mixer control. Note that with this patch, more shimmer will also result in longer decays because it is adding more feedback to the signal path. You can hear the effect taking place in slow motion by turning up the echo time. This gives an idea of what is actually taking place. This patch could also be performed using the morphogene. Set the input option to 1 on options.txt. Make a very short splice. Set vary speed all the way up for an octave up pitch shift. And engage TLA. Now the morphogene will make an instantaneous octave up copy of whatever goes in and can be mixed into the feedback path just as the echophone was. This approach is somewhat more transparent in terms of what is happening, especially if we start modulating gene size and more, making genes and digital layering more apparent. One thing to note is that as patched here, the shimmer is added immediately to the mix, and not just to the reverb itself. To emulate an internal shimmer effect, you would set the reverb to fully wet, and mix another copy of the dry signal with the reverb's output before monitoring. Try this out and see if you find it to be worth the extra patching. Let us know in the comments.